So, I bet you're all wondering when I got a BitCon 2017. Well, if you are, continue watching this video. Well, if you're continuing to watch this video, here is what I got from BookCon. First book I got was Odd and True by Cat Winters, who is a master of magical historical fiction. This follows two girls. Uh, they're trying to find some monsters and make sure that they survive, but one of the sisters might not be that trusting. So, we're going to see what happens here? This book is slated to come out in September of 2017. A book that is all over Instagram, Gunslinger Girl by Lindsay Eli. It is a James Patterson Presents books, and it is a steampunk novel that basically is she got a pair of six shooters and perfect aim. Uh, serendipity Pity Jones is the fastest sharpshooter in the West. She's been offered a life of fame and fortune in cessation. A decadent city where, law where lawlessness is a way of life, but the price she pays for her freedom just might cost her her life. This book is due to come out in January of 2018. Any Doctor Who fans in the house uh, or watching this video, say hello to Reincarnation Blues by Michael Poor. This book is exactly the way it's uh, the way it sounds. This there the main character uh whose name is Milo basically goes through 9995 chances of reincarnation so that he can be with his one true love. He has 5 chances left to be with his one true love. But get this, his one true love is death herself. This book is slated to come out uh, it does not say when but again be on the lookout for this. This I got from, Peng from Penguin Random House. Calling all bookstagrammers again. Another book that is all over bookstagram is Hunting Prince Dracula. This is book two in a series by Carrie Men Scalco. You can follow her on Instagram. And again, this is book two of the first book was Stalking Jack the Ripper, where we follow uh, Aubrey Rose Wadsworth, who wants to enroll in, in school and move on with her life. But when there's a bunch of deaths that happen, she, of course, is called to figure it out. This book is slated to come out in September 2017. The next book that I received is from Scholastic, and it is Girl in a Bad Place by Caitlin Ward. This book is due to come out October 31st of 2017. It is a contemporary young adult novel, and it is about exactly what it says, Girl in a Bad Place. Uh, follows a girl by the name of Kara, who I guess is trying to figure out, you know, which path she should take. And I think we all go through that you know, as we go through high school. Any Buffy the Vampire Slayer fans out there, this book is for you. Say hello to the epic crush of Jeannie Lowe, which is written by F.C. Yee. This is a fantasy paranormal young adult novel that follows Jeannie Lowe through her town in China. She's an Ivy League overachiever, does well on standardized tests, just as well in everything. But now she has to save her hometown from beasts that have escaped from hell. So this is definitely some this is definitely a book to keep your eyes on. Thank you to Abrams Books for this and this is due to come out in August of twenty seventeen. So I bet a bunch of us wanted to be Shadow Shapers growing up. Well, here's the sequel to Shadow Shaper by Daniel Rose Older, Shadow House Fall. It follows a girl by the name of Sierra and her friends who are Shadow Shapers, but some things just don't go right when she receives a card that has a beast on it from the House of Light. This book is from Scholastic, and it is due to come out September 12th, 2017. If you are a fan of the Red Abbey Chronicles, this book is also for you. This is from this is from Abrams Books, and it is Naudel by Maria Turtskanioff. I hope I pronounced that name right. This is a prequel to the Red Abbey Chronicles that 
essentially sets up all the story about the First Sisters and how exactly the Red Abbey came to be. This book is slated to come out January 2018. A contemporary young adult novel from Abrams Books called Water in May by Ismay Williams. This story, well this book follows a girl who really wants a family, really wants family members, really wants to feel loved, but she doesn't get that. And she's hoping that maybe with her pregnancy she might actually get that. This book is slated to come out in September of 2017. Check it out. A debut book from Marit Weisenberg called Select. This follows a girl by the name of Julia Janes who has superhuman powers. And unfortunately, she, uh, well, is supposed to be anonymous with them, but she is not. So her father banishes her to a place where no one really wants to be banished to. Public high school. Uh, definitely has an X-Men feel to it. And I'm, this is from Charles Bridge Team. And this book is slated to come out October 3rd. 2017. Also from Charles Bridge Team, you have Running Full Tilt, a novel by Michael Currender, who follows two boys uh, by the names of Leo and Caleb. Leo is Leo is the older brother of Caleb, who happens to be autistic, and dealing with his issues. They try and do their best to survive in a world that really doesn't understand or doesn't want to understand what he's going through. So this might be an interesting read. Well actually this might this will be an interesting interesting read. This book is slated to come out September fifth, twenty seventeen. And last but certainly not least, we have Bonfire by Kristen Ritter. Yes, that Kristen Ritter from Marvel's Jessica Jones, Don't Trust to Be in Apartment 23, and Gilmore Girls. This book follows Abby Williams, who's an environmental lawyer, who tried to basically make a new life for herself, but things just don't go well. Uh, this is a contemporary, what is a young adult, a uh, new adult maybe, and this book is slated to come out November 2017. So there you have it, all the books that I got from BookCon 2017. I am very looking forward to reading all of these books and reviewing all of them, which you can find on my blog. It is a joysy way of thinking, and I will put that link for my blog down below in the description. And if you are not already subscribed, please subscribe, and please make sure you hit that notification bell so I know that you're subscribed and that you know when I'm coming out with new videos. I do unboxing videos, I do book videos, I do anything that's basically bookish themed. Um, if you are not already, follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Uh, my name on Twitter is Joycey Danny, J-O-I-S-E-Y-D-A-N-I. -E my name on Instagram is Joycey Danny 78, J-O-I-S-E-Y-D-A-N-I -E 78. You can also catch my book segments and, uh, and other geeky things on Nerd Herders Radio, which you can find on Spreaker and Facebook Live every Friday at 9 p.m. I'll put a link for that down below, too. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you soon. Bye.